today, I felt like it would be fun to do a bit life let's play. Most of my bit life videos lately have been very structured and following like a certain criteria or a plan. But this time I kind of want to dive into it with like no plan at all. I want everything to just be in the spur of the moment about what I feel like. But yeah, I just want to have it be a little spontaneous. Starting from now on though, I am bringing back our post notification shout out. So if you guys want a shout out in my next video, all you have to do is turn on post notifications, comment down, down below. I removed it only temporarily because I was trying to get back into the flow of filming. Let's just get into our let's play though. Okay, so we are just gonna start a new life and I'm gonna randomize 10 times. I want literally nothing to be too structured. I want to be completely random so I get surprised. So we're gonna do 10 times. So one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so we're Alex from Greece. Our special talent is crime, so maybe we'll do a little bit of crime today. Haven't done that in a while, honestly. And this is our appearance. Okay, we have luscious locks. Save that. Our attributes. We'll see what we've been given. We have mediocre discipline. Okay, high fertility. <laughs> Hundred baby child. <laughs> good happiness, good health. We have like average karma. We're straight. We have good looks. We're decently smart and we have good willpower. So we're just gonna save that and we're gonna start. I don't know what we're gonna do, but we'll just see. So I was born a male in Santorini, Greece. I was conceived on my parents' honeymoon. Oh, we love that. I wish I would have said where our honeymoon was. My birthday is December 11th. I'm a Sagittarius. So my mother is a firefighter and my father is a mail carrier and I have an older brother, Jim. He's four. Okay, so gotta compete with him for the inheritance. As we know, our special talent was crime, so. <laughs> We have a dog and her name is Misty. That's so cute. Okay, so we're just gonna age. Let's see what happens. My plan is kind of <sighs> crime, you know, inheritance. Oh, we should check our parents some money. Why is that always my go-to? Oh, daddy got money. What about mommy's money? Ooh. <laughs> Why am I so excited? I have croup. Am I gonna die? <laughs> My mother is calling towards you in a soft voice. You feel inclined to respond. How will you react? A little boy named John wants to be your friend. Should we have friends? You know, having friends might make us seem like likable people. So when we commit our crimes, like no one's gonna be suspicious. No one can say, Alex had no friends because we have John. What should we do with John? Can we even do anything at our age? We can have a conversation about my imaginary friend. Maybe our imaginary friend is John. Oh my God, our imaginary friend becomes self-aware like AI. That would be scary. My mother wants to take me to get vaccinated. Alex going to be a good child or is he gonna cause trouble? Maybe we'll throw a fit. Um, <laughs> lately when anyone has irritated me, I imagine what it would take to make them disappear. <laughs> is this about Jim? <laughs> Listen, Alex has a little bit of <laughs> problems. <laughs> See, me and Jim are beefing. We're squabbling about who a certain toy belongs to. Listen, attack. Okay, we're gonna punch his skull. He stormed me. He impaled my eyelid. So far, no juvie at five. So that's a win. Me and my brother though have beef. Let's rumble with him. Claw. Nothing is better than a good old fashioned roundhouse kick. Okay, roundhouse kick his throat. No, his forehead. Oh, the damage wasn't even that bad. Oh my gosh, he backhanded my rump. You're starting primary school and it's private. Parents got money. Parents got money. We're gonna try and become a perfect son so no one is suspicious when we get the inheritance. <laughs> Study harder. We're gonna try to get good grades. Can we go to the library at this age? Let's see. Um, no, we can't. Okay, Um, that's not fair. I should be able to study freely. I should probably hang out with John so he doesn't leave me. Um, Let's go to a party. I hated it, but he loved it. Okay, we do not like social gatherings. A kid from school named Jim. Are you sure it's not my brother? Is sending everyone links to obscene websites with videos of people doing weird things. Um, click the first video, you know. Listen, Alex is a little like, I've enjoyed playing Valorant since I can't shoot people in real life. Alex, you need to chill. Oh my God, I also twisted Angie's belly button. It was an Audi. Oh, I'm crushing on my classmate, Sonia. You mean Tanya? You're thinking about asking her out. Ask her out. We're going out with Sonia. We should get eloped. <laughs> Compliment her. We called her attractive. Uh, that's so funny. We're 10. I asked out my classmate, Sonia. I am now going out with Sonia. I called Sonia attractive. Yo, John hates me. Okay, bye. I don't care. I have a girlfriend now. <laughs> we have to be the perfect student. So I have to study harder. I think we're old enough to go to the library now. We are. Oh, no. Didn't mean to do that. Library. I hated it. But it's all about keeping up the image. Okay, okay, John hates me, but for some reason he's like not leaving the friendship. So, <laughs> but we're just gonna keep talking to our girl. Should I propose to her? 
Okay, she rejected me for in secondary school. We're literally in private school. Like, my parents are rich. So, how old are they? How old are my parents? My dad's 47. My mom is 49. I am so angry. Hold on, where's the salon and spa? I need to show you guys my face. Look how angry I am. <laughs> I'm an angry child. We need some love. But I can't cheat on Tanya, I mean. Sonia. My parents want me to start taking tuba lessons. You know, I'll do it just for them. But that doesn't mean I'm going to continue it. <laughs> oh, they got me a gold brass tuba. Okay, we'll accept it. I would sell it, but you know, we're trying to like be the angel child for our parents. But listen, we're 16, which means we're old enough to do a little crime. Um, and it has to be the brother. <laughs> He put antifreeze in his iced tea. Attend his funeral? Oh my god. We weren't caught. Yo, that feels so messed up. Oh my god. And he had hemorrhoids too. Poor Jim. Literally listen to this. My big brother Jim has been diagnosed with hemorrhoids. My parents wanted me to start taking tuba lessons. So I took tuba lessons. So my parents bought me a new gold brass tuba. I also had dark thoughts. I poured antifreeze in my big brother Jim's iced tea when he wasn't looking. He died. My big brother Jim was murdered. I paid respects at his funeral. That paragraph right there is the most insane thing I've ever read. Any teen will propose and no one will know. Alex Lenthemos has a double life. He plotted against Jim. He has depression. Oh gosh, we have to make him happy. Let's hang out with our girlfriend. Movie theater, cause it's free. She hated it, but I loved it. That's what matters. <laughs> Just have to call her an OG and she's happy. But Alex Lanthimos has plotted this since day one. He was gonna get rid of his brother to get the inheritance and no one would ever suspect him. This is like a movie. <laughs> okay, we're officially 18. We're gonna take some time off. We no longer have depression, that's good. Driver's test will take, we pass. Not my rich parents getting me a Mercedes Benz. More expensive car, please. That's because I'm their only child left, so they're trying to make me happy. That makes me feel really bad. But we're gonna not scrap it. Oh my gosh, we're gonna sell it. Nobody wanted it, please, please. I don't believe you. I don't believe you. Trying to lowball me 20,000, no, insist. Oh, they agreed. Okay, period. Okay, now I'm gonna be able to afford a ring. So should I do a fake one? <laughs> and proposed her with the fake one. I think I should, because we're living a fake life. Okay, let's get the most expensive diamond ring. Buy it. We'll propose with it. Hopefully she doesn't realize. If she does, we might have to fake diamond ring at fancy resort. She rejected it. Argue back. Are you joking? That's not fair. Did I at least get to keep the ring? Do they always notice? No. I'll give her one more chance. Elegant restaurant. <laughs> you gotta disappear from society. <laughs> Oh no, a police officer says that if you want to avoid getting arrested, you should stop committing crime. Should I run for it? Or cooperate? I think we cooperate because we're trying to live a double life. Oh, I don't think I can afford that. <laughs> oh god, I got a life sentence. I think my inheritance is gone. <laughs> um, listen, I don't got to do the mini games, so I'm gonna escape. I escaped, I escaped. Oh, <gasps> my parents hate me. No. That means I lose the inheritance and everything was for nothing. Compliment my parents. Um, <laughs> give them a gift. This cannot happen. Give them another gift. A PlayStation 4? That is what I called getting an inheritance. <laughs> Movie theater? No. I don't know what to do. I'm gonna get caught again. Okay, now it's time for my mom. What's a gift I can give her? Yeah, a, a, a smart speaker? I, I don't know. Okay, mommy's good. I'm gonna age, but I'm scared. Maybe I should legally change my name. I know the best thing to do is emigrate, but I can't remember if we get the money. So let's just go to identity, name change. Let's do 10. I didn't mean to do that. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Demetrius. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Kafalas. Okay. File a request. My father's mad at me because I changed my name. I'm sorry. Please don't tell me he's mad at me again. Oh my gosh, this man. Listen, father, do not take a personal. I'm on the run. This this is not now. Now's not the time. I'm gonna give you a globe and he hates me. <laughs> Coach sunglasses. I am running out of money, sir. Be grateful. <laughs> Fly to university. Should we enlist in the military? That'd be so ironic now. Nah. We're just gonna tick him off. We're gonna lay on the low. We literally dodged a life sentence. That was crazy. Question is, is do I hit man the family? That might be what we have to do, you guys. Hire him. Use the brick. <laughs> That's so aggressive and for what? Plan his funeral. Donate his body to science. Oh gosh, I need my mother to love me more. Um, 
Um, coffee maker. Oh gosh. I need to be able to flee. Conversation. We have a good relationship. I should age one more year. Okay. We have anxiety. That's fine. Let's go back to our hitman. Your mom. I think, I think using hitman gives us the inheritance. I don't think murder does. Yo, they used a brick and then a cane. Donate. Oh baby, I got the inheritance. Even though I was literally found guilty of Sonya, they literally forgave me <laughs> and gave me the money anyways. Okay. Now we have to flee. Okay. We should probably get out of Europe completely to be safe. Oh, should we do Canada because I'm in Canada. Quest approval. <gasps> they approve. They have no idea what I've done. We are in Ottawa. <laughs> Should I just like pretend to have a normal life now? Like, can you believe I'm 21 and all this has happened <laughs> by the time I was 21? Should I like get married, get a house, have kids? I mean, okay, I should sell all evidence of what has happened. So sell the tuba. We're going to just donate the ring to charity. Let's become a traditional suburban husband. We're gonna get a minivan. We're gonna get a moderate house. So let's get a craftsman home. Okay, buy with cash. We're going to get a minivan, a Dodge Charger, a Honda Odyssey. So Honda Odyssey. Oh, it's used. Do we want new? Honda Odyssey. Let's just get it. Buy with cash because we have it. <laughs> I wonder how. Okay, so we're financially stable for our future wife, you know, so we can support her and love her. Should I be a blacksmith and an electrician? Electricians make good money. Let's do that. How are you most likely to invest your money in hitmen? <laughs> this organization, that sounds good. Okay, let's add our hours to our schedule. This is so fun to have this be completely random. I'm not gonna lie, I should do this more because this has been crazy. <laughs> we're gonna work harder at our job. Oh my God, maybe we like marry our boss. <laughs> let's just go on the dating app that's what everybody does nowadays you know kids these days mail order bride please <laughs> dating app we'll, we'll go 2029 that should be fine net worth doesn't matter oh okay we'll go with her she's a dishwasher she's cute she's about our age so we'll go on a date with jenna that's so cute okay oh my god she has no idea what my past life has been like <laughs> poor jenna honestly we are going to propose right away we're gonna buy a diamond ring we're gonna make it real let's buy a diamond ring five no i don't have the money for that <laughs> Do a three million dollar ring. No, bad quality. I'll wait a year, okay? I'll wait. I'll wait till next year to see the ring. We are going to spend time with her and age. <laughs> she wants to take it to the next level. I want to wait till marriage. <laughs> Oh God, okay, compliment her, I'm sorry, Jenna. I don't know why I'm choosing this lifestyle. Wow, they're so expensive. We're just gonna go sapphire ring then, honestly, whatever. <laughs> Jenna, I'm sure you'll love it. So let's propose fancy resort. It, we should have like three kids, you know, and we'll have a really fancy wedding. Golf course in London. No, we have to stay out of Europe. Australia, we don't need a prenup. Keep my last name. She hyphenated, we love it. Listen, all this right here, None, none of this happened. We're starting fresh. Let us stop taking our birth control. It's baby time. <laughs> twins, give me twins. Okay, we have a boy, Lincoln. I love that name. Reminds me of prison break. And we'll have another one. I want to have three kids. Yes, so Elijah. Okay, we need a girl. We need a girl. Wow, Jenna is fertile. A boy. <laughs> you know what? How many rooms is our house? We might have to upgrade our house. Four bedroom. That's perfect. The main bedroom's for us. The other one are for the kids. We love it. Maybe we'll get pregnant. Maybe we won't. We'll stop trying, but you just heard that your son, Elijah, cut another child's hair in class without the other kid's permission. He is just like his father. Do nothing. Good job, son. <laughs> While out for a walk, you see a lady tied to the railroad tracks. Listen, we will look the other way. <laughs> Demetrius is doing his best, but listen, he's not perfect. And unfortunately, the lady had... A bad day. That's all I'll say. Nolan has scarlet fever. Oh, we got a girl, Isabella. That's so cute. And I have a toe bump. Chug some water. Ha, ah, it's gone. We should go on a family vacation. First class to Brazil. Bring everyone. Oh, everyone's happy. Oh, we forgot to get a dog. We have to get a dog. We'll get a golden retriever. She's not too crazy. I mean, we would love her if she was crazy anyways. Her name's Isabella, like my daughter. No, we have to change it. That's so cute. We'll go with that. Oh. Okay, spend time with her. Oh, we have a perfect relationship with everyone. Look at Demetrius living his best life. Jenna's pregnant again. I need to get another house. There's no room. Oh my gosh, another girl, Alexandra. Okay, we have to sell this house and get another one. We also have to do maintenance on our car. Okay, because the condition's going down. Oh, it doesn't even help the condition. You should be able to like do that. Okay, we have to sell our house. Sell it and we have to get a bigger house. Oh, a castle. Seven bedroom, that's perfect. Ask her, she loves the garden. Buy it. We'll buy with cash, of course. Amaya died after eating 
onion. Oh, that's messed up. How could you do that to Amaya? Okay, it's time for Elijah to go to college. He wants to major in accounting. Yes, son, I'll pay for your tuition. Oh, Nolan also, he wants to do graphic design. That's a lot of money. Yes, son. Did we just get recruited to the mafia? <laughs> the Russian mafia. Does Demetrius end up turning into like Marty Bird and like joining? <laughs> oh my god, what do I do? do if this was in the beginning of the video, obviously I'd say yes. But I'm supposed to be making his life better. I mean, his wife don't gotta know. My finger slipped. <laughs> I wonder what happened. <laughs> I forgot how the mafia works. I haven't done it in a while. Oh, they all hate me. <laughs> Um, crime? Um, Grand Theft Auto is the best one. Honda Accord. <laughs> Contribute to the family. We're just gonna do Grand Theft Auto. That's it. Volkswagen. You've been ordered to report to the family. Oh my god, my boss smiled at me. I did a bank robbery too. Please contribute the full amount. Let's extort a business of all their money. Throw her out of a window. She didn't even give me the full amount. That's annoying. Your boss has ordered you to shake down a forklift operator who accidentally forked the czar, czar mammoth's niece. Do it, of course. Here's with an ice pick. <laughs> I have been promoted to a soldier. I've just spent the past couple of minutes doing a bunch of like Grand Theft Auto, bank robberies, making them a lot of money. And then I correctly identified a rat and now I've been promoted. Demetrius is going back to his old ways, okay? And one of the best ways to find a rat is finding someone that's smiling. And that's what I did. And that's how I reported them. Oh no, it's caught by SWAT. Run for it. I was caught. You've been charged with burglary, racketeering, and running from the police and are facing 11 years in prison. Listen, at least they don't know what we did in Greece. Maybe this is how Demetrius finally redeems himself, is getting the mafia caught. The prosecution has offered you an opportunity to walk free if you agree to become a confidential informant. Agree. Oh gosh, I'm going to die. <laughs> oh, I have a maximum of three years. I forget how to be an informant. We collected evidence, okay? Um, okay, so I need evidence against a lot of people. This associate, maybe. Oh, that one wasn't as good. Can we do it multiple times? Okay, shoot, okay. I can't do it against the boss, can I? That's like kind of scary. Okay, we got evidence against this person. Shoot, what if I get caught though? <laughs> I'm scared. Oh, oh I already did her. <laughs> Should I do him? Oh my God, that was not good. I shouldn't have done that. Okay, I have to make sure I don't look too suspicious. So let me at least do the Grand Theft Auto. So we'll steal that. Contribute it. Maybe we'll contribute only a little bit. Okay, I thought they were about to like expose me, but we're good. Okay, I'll just age. I don't want to do too much. I don't want like the FBI to be mad at me. <gasps> Family associate wants to go drop rocks. Okay, this person's probably a rat. Wait, that's. <sighs> I have to not look suspicious though. Oh god, expose him as a rat. <gasps> oh, not a rat. Oh god, I'm I don't even know he's not a rat. Damn it. Okay, I need- Oh no, I ruined my relationship with the boss. Oh no, I can't collect evidence on anybody. <sighs> okay, we did there. Oh no. They accused me of collecting evidence. Whack him before he tells anyone. Oh my gosh. Um, buzzsaw. Buzzsaw. Uh oh. I've been beaten by the family. Oh no, they made me dig my own grave. Lie down and buried me alive. What a way to go. Um, Demetrius died um at the age of 51. <laughs> His services were attended by his devoted wife, Jenna, and his five loving children. Demetrius found his way into the Russian mafia's infamous Anatovalinva... Uh, infamous crime family, I can't say it. Friends smiled when remembering how he once called his father a closer? I don't know what that means, but I really thought I was gonna be good as an informant. The FBI or CIA should have protected me more. But did Demetrius deserve it? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe he did. <laughs>